Sorry, Opal's crying in the background right now, but today I'm starting my kind of Dallas day one vlog. I'm going to BeautyCon tomorrow, and today we are driving down to Dallas, and yeah, it's going to be pretty fun, I think. So today we're going to go just to our hotel and then get a massage, and then there's actually like a BeautyCon pre-party thing tonight that I think I'm probably going to go to. So right now I don't have like any makeup on or anything, but for the party I'm probably going to like do some sort of makeup look and put on a different dress, because right now I'm just wearing my usual t-shirt dress not the most flattering and yeah it's like almost 11 30 and we are going to head out soon i just finished packing like a few minutes ago and i don't even know if i'm completely done so still gotta go and check on that and i've been having to eat so much like soft foods lately i still cannot completely chew with my braces which is kind of annoying sorry opal we have to leave you behind oh i'm gonna miss her she's sitting for i don't know what crying for you no I love you. I haven't used my wax yet, but I'm starting to get blisters, so glad I did. And by the way, we're on the way. We've been sitting in traffic for like an hour and a half, and our massage is at four, so we're probably going to miss that. But like, literally, it's just at a standstill. Nobody's moving, and it's taken so long. Like, neither of us have ever been in traffic this bad, and it really sucks. You can see in my rear view mirror what's happening there. Absolutely nothing. We're just sitting here. But what's going on with all these people getting out of their cars? Because it's like a standstill. Isn't this kind of weird? Everybody's just walking around. I know. This rest area is popping over here. We're just like parked outside the road and going to this like rest stop area no, because go, the traffic is absolutely horrible. And we already had to cancel our massage appointment. Fun. I don't know. I think. Is that it? Yeah. Look at all, look at all those oil tanks. I think that's what fell over. Yeah. There was some sort of fuel spill here. Was Finally, it that? was it that thing? Maybe I don't know. It took us two hours worth of traffic for this. Finally made it to a heavenly place for a break. Chipotle. I just got my Chipotle bowl. Hopefully I can eat it. It looks really good. And we also got chips and guac. I'll eat the guac, but sadly, none of their delicious chips anymore. But it's still good. After six hours of driving, there you can see downtown Dallas. Finally, I just took like a little kind of mini nap. And yes, we are finally almost to the hotel. Hi guys, so we are finally at our hotel in Dallas. It's a little bit like not downtown because we thought we were going to like a mall and a place for our massages originally, but you know, because of the horrible traffic, our plans kind of shifted, but we're still going to the um, BeautyCon pre-party tonight and hopefully that'll be fun. I'm not gonna wear this. I'm gonna wear like a nice dress. Well, not really that nice, it's just like a dress and then do my makeup and everything. So we're gonna relax for a little bit and then go to that party tonight. And we actually got a suite here, so there's like a whole bunch of space, um, you can see. And yeah, I got like this little living area and two beds and not much of a view, but like, it's okay. And we have like a full little microwave kitchen, so yeah, it's pretty nice. I think I just finished getting ready for the BeautyCon kickoff party. And I don't know, I feel like I don't look really how I wanted to, but it's okay. I'm hoping it's like darkly lit. These shoes are just my plain black sandals. This like tie-dye dress is from American Eagle. From the front, it's just like a normal tie-dye dress, but then the back uh, is like the cutest part. So hopefully you can see that there, really cute. And then the crystal necklace I always wear. And I can't decide how I want to do my hair right now. It's just down, but I might change it into a side braid if I feel like it. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing. And I tried out, like it was not a good idea. I tried out a new foundation, like literally the day of the party and it's not really covering my like a friend on my forehead, but that's okay. And it's a little bit past seven now. The party's from seven to 10. So yeah, I think we're probably gonna leave soon. Now my hair is in like a little puffed up braid, but I do not like this hair tie. So I'm hoping we have a black one in the car. If not, then I'll have to forfeit this whole thing. My mom and her OOTD, here we go. All right, you want to tell us like where everything's from? Uh, we just got this at Cotton On. I think these are from H&M. My boots, I can't remember where those are from. I don't know where my boots or my sweater are from. Sorry. You look good. So we found a black hair tie, it's kind of noticeable, and there is no hairspray in the car, unfortunately, but it is already like 7.30 and we're gonna get to the party at like 7.45, so we're finally going to head over. There we are, downtown Dallas. Oh, you kind of you can see it off in the distance. Check it in. There's the beauty con thing. People. No. Oh. It's really dark in here, but I made it inside, which is exciting. My mom just got a burger, and here's beauty con dollars. Yeah, that's cute. Food everywhere. I can't believe that. Are you going to edit yourself? Yeah. 
I can eat. I think I'm gonna get something for dinner. They had this here. I'm about to finally have dinner at like 11. Now we are finally back in the hotel room. It has been a very long day and long night and I'm finally gonna eat some food. And yeah, I had a lot of fun at that party. So shout out to BeautyCon for inviting me. It was really fun and I was glad I got to meet a lot of the people that I wanted to see at BeautyCon. And yeah, you're probably seeing this vlog um, a few days later because it really has been a hectic day. But stay tuned for the actual BeautyCon Dallas Day vlog. And I still need to shower and eat and set everything up. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Bye guys. Different, truly, I ain't got no business here. But since my friends are here, I just came to kick it. But really, I would rather be at home all by myself, not in this room with people who don't even care about my well being. I don't dance, don't ask. I don't need a boyfriend, so you can't go back.